do you mean by that, Pastor? I'm talking about some people just follow him to have the name on the road of the church. They don't want to know more about Jesus. They don't want to follow him just as long as they can sing in the choir. But they really don't want to know Jesus. There are those of us who want to know Jesus just on Sunday morning. By lunchtime at the buffet, you will forget about her. this man named Jesus. Can I talk this? Can I talk this evening? Have I got any help in here? I, I believe that many of us who are sitting in the pews tonight, we really need to re-examine. Do we really know him? Or do we just have a form of knowledge? But not according to have I got any up in here? Yeah. Is there some folks that as long as their name is on the road of the church, they're fine. Yeah. But they don't want to know anything about the forgiving aspects of God. Yeah. They don't want to know anything about the loving aspects of Jesus. Yeah. To know Jesus means you have to put up with stuff yeah. that you don't want to put up with. Yeah. To really know Jesus means that you got to forgive folks that you don't want to forgive. I wish I had some help out there. To really know the Lord, that means you got to be able to one day go to Calvary for somebody in order for them to live again. Are y'all going to talk to me? And in order to know him, you got to reposition yourself. Have I got any help in here? You have got to move from the periphery of Christ to front and center. Can I talk about that? Because there are many of us who are on the periphery of the kingdom of God. We are around the church, but we're not in the church. Can I get any up here? We're, we're close enough, but we're not too close that we can't get run over. And people can't talk about us and throw our name in the bag and make us feel bad. We're on the periphery. And Andrew said that, and you know, Jesus said, in order for you to follow me or to know me, you got to reposition yourself. You got to get off of the periphery, the parameters of the church, and you got to get involved in the church. I'm preaching right now. Have I got any up in here? Do I have any up in here? The Bible says that they followed him. From a distance. Yeah. Look at your name and say, from a distance. Yeah. In other words, if anything went down, yeah. they could run fast. Yeah. I wish they had some help. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody know anybody that's, that's been scared? They, they always on the back side. Yeah. 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 In case yeah. something go down, they're on the back side. Yeah. Yeah. They, they, they're the last one in the door and then the first one out. know who I am. You got to reposition yourself. You got to stop sitting on the bottom of the arm and the back row of the church and come up for yourself. I wish I had some Holy Ghost children. I said I wish I had some Holy Ghost children. You got to be the last. You got to stop being the last one getting the church and the first one to have the church to open the door of the church. Just look at me at all. 
There are some folks that come to church that just want to be in awe. Yeah. And how good the choir sing. Yeah. Yeah. How many know the choir can sing better than you would say amen? Yeah. Yeah. I, I wish I had it. I can't remember. How many know that, that people can pray better if you would say, go on and pray? Yeah. Talk to the Lord. Yeah. How many know that the preacher can preach a lot better if you stop looking at me like I'm on television and give me a word? I'm 